Hi, it's Ozzy from Three Monkeys, coming to you from Raleigh, North Carolina, in my kitchen. It's Sunday, and I figured I'd do a little quick video for you to demonstrate one of the qualities of our DC solderless system used for powering your pedal boards. Um, the concept I'd like to talk to you about today is torsion. And torsion is what makes this a very secure system for you to use on your pedal board. Um, well, first I should explain why torsion is important. Uh, you may or may not know how these connectors work, but essentially what it is is a brass connector that is threaded inside. So the cable is threaded into the unit. You don't need to strip the wire. You don't need to do anything other than take a box cutter and chop it off clean cut at the end and insert it screw it into just like if you could turn if you could screw in a light bulb you can make one of these connectors it's foolproof so there you go i just screwed this side in i've already have a piece of pre-cut cable here um, screwing it in the other side over here as well and what happens when you're screwing this in is those threads that we were talking about earlier they actually cut the insulator we designed this cable specifically for this purpose the insulator is able to be cut by the threads the threads may contact with the shield and as the wire is forced down into the unit the center conductor makes contact with a pin located at the bottom of the threaded insert see so basically it is held tight that way so pulling the thing out is basically a non-starter that's not going to happen unless you've been lifting a lot of weights and you're really pulling on it um but what we're here to talk about is essentially the torsional system okay so torsion what is it and why is it important well torsion is when you have something let's say like this cable and on one side you're going in one direction and on the other side you're going in the other direction that creates stress right um that is the secret as to why this cable will not back out of this connector. Um, a lot of people might think just on offhand, well, if it screws in, why can't it screw out? And if there's no Loctite or any kind of glue or any kind of set screw or something to keep it in, how is it just not going to back out? Well, this is the reason why it won't. Torsion. Um, all right, let's say you wanted to back out this thread, right? You would go in a counterclockwise direction, right? All right, so that will back out the cable from the unit. The interesting part is on the other side of the cable, when you go to the other pole, so to speak, it's now clockwise in relation to the threads. So in order for this side to back out, this side has to get tighter. And if you've done a good job tightening both sides, it's not gonna go any further that way, so it can't come out this way. And that's what we have a torsional system. And that's why you should not worry about the cable backing out of this connector.